Hi, we are the Beals. We bought a 2014 Whitewater Riverside Retro 155 travel trailer. Today we're taking it out for the first time to camp in Cleelum, Washington. Watch us learn what works and what doesn't. Ready for the first night in the bed. Just gonna see how comfortable it is. This is the mattress that came with it. Look at that, Jerry. We have a little bed and lights and a bathroom and a refrigerator and a sink. I took a sponge bath. We don't quite have the shower working yet because the parts are on at Bob's house. It's pretty cool, Jerry. Thanks for letting me buy a trailer. Glad you're happy. Can you tell? It? Can you tell? It's the first time I've sat still in like two weeks. <laughs> I think I was overheated. I was a little mopey. I didn't want to do anything. But I'm not mopey now. Well, honey, how'd you sleep? I slept, but I woke up quite a few times. Part of the problem was my pillow. Yeah, my the other part was just, I felt like I was shoved in this corner. <laughs> I don't know that I was, or I was trying not to squish you. Yeah, I mean, we have a whole nother bed we can set up so that we have more space. I just, I brought the wrong pillow, so I was cranking my neck all night. Yeah, because I wanted a pillow I could keep in here. Yeah, I was waking up all night because my neck was getting cranked. And then I also was on top of the blankets and I couldn't get under them to get honey blankets. So I was up for a couple hours. So, got to figure this out. So today it was like 90 degrees at camp uh, where we're at in Salem. And so we decided to get lunch do some shopping and go to a movie. So first we got lunch at a restaurant that Jerry picked, which turned out to be, I think, Mennonite bread. Not something you see every day here. And then we went to Fred Meyer and bought some stuff for the trailer. And then we went to see the movie Black Widow everyone said it was good. It was fine. I didn't fall asleep. What did you think about the movie itself? Like watching a live action cartoon? Yeah, like a cartoon. Very I, I guess it's comic book characters, right? Yeah. I, I'm not familiar with the backstory comic book. Or no. Lots of explosions, fight scenes. Uh, Exploding fights, yeah. fight scenes, right? Super villains. Yeah, yeah. super villains. Fake. Martial arts, just like that. And unfortunately, the theater did not have good soundproofing, so you could hear the movie yeah. <laughs> on the opposite side of the screen the whole time. Whatever it was, it was like it was a documentary or something. Yeah, it had narration. There, yeah, really loud male narrator voice in the background. So every quiet, somewhat tender moment in the movie was overshadowed by this booming and 
discernible voice. But, you know, we went to a movie theater, it was cash only. Everything was a little sketchy at that movie theater. When I went to the bathroom, when I, the toilet flushed on me three times and I couldn't get water out of the sink and just did do one squirt. And then I went to the next thing, one squirt. So I think they were probably money laundering. Uh, and running a fake movie theater or something was sketchy. Or you're in Ellensburg. Anything can happen in Ellensburg, That's apparently. What you get. Yep. And tonight we are trying separate beds. Good morning. Last day of our first trip out with the trailer. Jerry and I tried sleeping on opposite sides because these are really two twin beds and. I slept good until I got up to go to the bathroom at four and I had a hard time getting back to sleep. But other than that, I was good. I'm gonna ask how Jerry slept. Did you sleep through over in the other bed better or did you still wake up because you were being smashed? I still wake up why? Feeling smashed. Oh, you okay. No. Good. So I was just telling Jerry this and I figured out that this little trailer world is perfect for me. I do dishes while sitting in bed. I can open the refrigerator and sit on the floor. I prep vegetables while sitting at the dinette. Like, it's just the perfect little world where I can reach everything and do everything and then don't feel like a disabled person. A little kitchen? Your little kitchen. For outdoor cooking. Uh, it's my tailgate with my aluminum sheet tabletop and half of my Coleman, is it Coleman? Yeah, Coleman table. The other half's over here. We can eat with it. And it's not very level right now. No, it's kind of going that way. Mm -hmm. I don't even bother. Mm -mm. We're using these camping chairs for the first time that I got as a retirement gift. Look how cute the trailer is. So cute. Well, we took her out. First time off. First time with the trailer, and we're off grid. Right? Technically, yeah. Technically, hey, and this road isn't paved, so are we overlanding? <laughs> 
driveways are pretty overlandy. Driveways. electricity problems we never even used our jackery knockoff oh you never got it out we never got it out well we took the car into town so i checked charged my phone on the car yeah so and i only edited for about 20 minutes all told so i didn't use up the battery wow you can hear the electricity that's crazy as i'll get out can you imagine if that was your job trailer. Wow. It's like, are we driving it or is it driving us? Click right here to watch another trip or click down here to watch a video that YouTube picked up just for 